Yeah. It's the bald and the beautiful. They know all about you. Everything from Nashville to Hollywood on My Country 96.1. All right, we start with Luke Bryan, who announced the final six dates to his Vegas residency, three in December, three in January. So if you're looking to go check out Luke and take a trip to Vegas at the same time, uh, you have limited time. You can go check out those dates and get those flights booked. Megan Maroney, her new video for her big single, I'm Not Pretty, is out, and you can check it out. It's everywhere. So big news last night from Taylor Swift. Uh, She just announced it, I guess, around midnight or so. 1989, Taylor's version will be out October 27th. Um, This will be the fourth re-release, the fourth Taylor's version album, which will only leave two left. You know, if you don't know the story, uh, somebody sold the musical rights to her writings out from under her. And she wanted to take all those rights back. So she said, you know what? I'm just going to re-record all the albums that I do not own the rights to anymore. And uh, this will be the fourth of six. And it comes out October 27th, one of her biggest albums of all time, 1989. And uh, you can go check that out. Pre-order for the holidays. Robbie Robertson of the band uh, passed at the age of 80, a long illness that he suffered with. And the band, if you're not familiar, old school group uh, with some huge songs. The Wait, uh, The Night They Drove Old Dixie Down, Up on Cripple Creek, just a a ton of hits. And uh, Robbie Robertson wrote all of those and uh, passed at the age of 80. Chris Tucker, the comedian, announced his first tour, first comedy tour in over a decade. Um, You can go check out the dates. I I do not have them in front of me. I do not know about any of the local dates. I'm not that interested, but um, it is big news. Chris Tucker, at one point, one of the biggest comedians in the world and uh, movie star and all that stuff, and is going back out on tour. Van Halen has decided to remaster the Sammy Hagar years. They stayed away from it for a while. Uh, Now they're issuing a box set all remastered stuff of uh, Sammy and the time with the band. And look, I love David Lee Roth, uh, but the Sammy years were formative years for me. 5150, OU812, huge albums, and uh, others as well. Those will be out. In L.A., teacher uh, received a life-saving kidney transplant thanks to new kids on the block. That's right, so she showed up at a show with a sign talking about how she needed a kidney, and a fan from Wisconsin got in touch with her, and long story short, uh, the band put them together, and the rest is history. She got her new kidney. That's incredible. Uh, Dartford, England, the hometown of Mick Jagger and Keith Richards, have unveiled two bronze statues, one of each of them. (laughs) It's kind of (laughs) interesting. Walk through a town and See a statue of Mick Jagger there with a microphone staring at you. Uh, But yeah, they just unveiled those in Dartford, England. David Harbour of Stranger Things says once the show wraps up, he wants to focus more on movie roles instead of walking down the street the rest of his life with people yelling Hopper at him, uh, his character in Stranger Things. And uh, bad news if you're a Disney Plus or Hulu fan or you know you have the uh, registration there you know the signed up for it right uh the price is going up very soon on those two tv tonight some preseason football all around uh, different channels including the nfl network cbs with big brother and the challenge usa second season premiere and another reality show where they battle it out for prizes uh cw fight to survive is what it's called. And they're actually playing for $250,000 and they're on a remote island and they fight each other uh, to move on. So interesting. Uh, I I actually may, if I remember, may uh, flip that one on, on the CW. And there you have it. You're bald and the beautiful entertainment, everything from Nashville to Hollywood. Uh, We are going to have a tough afternoon of rain starting around noonish. It could be noon, one, two o'clock. Depends where you live, but Early afternoon, a ton of rain coming in, including some thunderstorms, and just be on the lookout. 
as we go from a decent start to a lot of rain very quickly today. Let's hit the roads, my country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.